Alright, well, I'm thinking gunpowder on the dam. I always thought we had to blow this, so we gotta use a flint with something. Holy shit, water slide! Whoops. Pardon me. That was awesome. Man, how did I end up back up there? I rode it. Oh, he's down. Sweet. Alright. Anything else to do here? He doesn't look good. Alright, well. That wasn't so hard after all. Now we have a secondary rope. We can, uh... Go from stump to the bottom here. Looks sturdy. Does it? Now rope it. Yup. Whee! Now we can take the oars. Hmm. It's spooky, and I'm not going any further. It's spooky, right, and I'm fine, not going dude, any you further. Pussy. Grow some balls. Of course, I shouldn't say that. I just posted, uh, or I'm in the. At the moment, I'm posting the uh, like best scares montage video. Obviously, I'm no more of a man than Guybrush is. Let's use the oars with. I can boat. paddle it with these oars. Okay, do it. Sweet! Should we go rescue our crew? Nope, just whatever. They were layabouts anyway. They didn't do nothing for nobody. Alright, so I obviously gotta get to the other side, so meet you there. Alright, here we are on the further beach. We got a note here. Cannibals. I'm not giving you bloodsuckers your key to the monkey head until you return my banana picker. HT. Is this is that monkey the banana picker or what? I no understand. Just go to the closest one. All right. These stupid vultures just keep following me. Spooky. Ah oh, man, Campbell Village. I don't know why we're being so gung ho. Just strolling right in. Oh, how quaint. The ambiance. Just lovely. How do you even get up there? I can't see inside from here. It's an empty hut. Okay. Why? It's empty. Whatever, dude. I thought I was the one playing this game. Evidently, you're the one making all the decisions. This hut is very empty. That's weird. Has this village been abandoned or something? Boy, this is the emptiest hut I've ever seen. Besides the last one. Mm, Alright. This door appears to be locked. How can they afford locks? Looks a little overripe. Except for those nice juicy bananas. Even more bananas. Okay. Now I have two more bananas. Do not waste them. It looks big and empty. It looks big and empty. I don't want to get any closer to that thing. Can I do it? It might be booby trapped. Throw the cannonball in there. I don't want to get any closer to that thing. Alright, whatever. It might be booby trapped. Can you take one of the spears? Seeing as you somehow don't have a sword anymore. Nothing left but bad fruit. All right, where can we go? Oh! Is that a banana in your pocket, or are you just glad to see us? Ha! Ah, classic. You've got a lot of nerve stealing from the notorious Monkey Island cannibals. Whoa, 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 whoa! You're cannibals? Well, yes. Although lately we've been trying to stay away from red meat. You guys sound Probably like. 
the uh, the, uh, the, uh, the, uh, the, uh, the the dudes, the oh, men of low moral fiber. Oh, tourists who try to steal our stuff for souvenirs. Well, what do you have to say for yourself? Look behind you! A three-headed monkey! Hey, do you really think we're that stupid? For about half a second, yes. I wouldn't push it if I were you. Oh god! Look behind you! A three-headed monkey! Ha! We're not going to fall for that old trick again. <laughs> it's for real this time. I guess we'll eat you now. No. Unless... If you had some sort of offering for us, something that we could pass on to the great monkey? You well, mean a three-headed monkey standing behind you? How about a... banana? Do you really think we want that after you've had your grubby paws all over it? Um... Cannonball? We've already got one of those. Spyglass? That's hardly an artifact worthy of the great monkey. Obviously, you have nothing for uh -oh. us. Uh-oh. We might eat you, we might let you go. We'll have to talk about it with the village nutritionist. Ha! Come, let me show you our guest hut. Oh, boy. That should do it. Oh, we're fucked. To the ghost pirate LeChuck. We must protest your acquisition of our voodoo anti root anti root We realize that it presents a hazard to you and your crew, but this is thievery. The Monkey Island Cannibals. Alright, that sounds like what we gotta get back for him. What a cute little skull. It's adorable. Huh. Ooh, loose board. Looks board. loose. Pick it up. I can see underneath the hut. Well, that was easy. And no, I'm not getting squeamish. I'd love to eat the guy. So let's do it. But think of your arteries. We are cannibals for crying out loud. You see how skinny that guy is? Yeah, but cannibals have I'm to very lean their saturated meat. fats just like everyone else. Alright, that was simple. So Whatever an anti root is, that's what we gotta get back. I'm assuming the great monkey is actually the uh, banana picker. Anyway, let's just move right along. Ah, the banana thief returns to the scene of the crime. Maybe we should just eat him right now. Do you have any idea how much cholesterol is in one of these things? Now then, how did you break out of our hut, and why did you come back? So I forgot those arms. Don't eat me. I'll give you anything. Anything? Hmm. We'll give you one more chance to trade something of yours for your freedom. Well... Uh... T-shirt. We've already got one of those. What? How about that? No one else is beating the sword man. the natural fibers, but no thanks. I'm sure you guys have terrible breath after all those humans Come you ate. On. You can do better than that. Oh, we're obviously fucked. you have nothing for us. That should do it. Really, all I wanted was to. <laughs> Oh, this is the banana picker. I get it. And I can just fit it in my back pocket. Alright. I thought it was just something I was going to need to use. No thanks. They've still got some meat on them. That's good nutrition. Oh, Vines. Get more ropes. I don't think hanging myself is the answer. <laughs> I said pick it up. Not. What are you thinking, Guy Rush? You're a very macabre man. Macabre. I didn't actually mean to pronounce it that way. I might fit through that hole, but I don't think this banana picker will. Oh, fuck. God damn it. Alright. So the banana picker cannot come with us. Alright, we 
gotta get the anti route then before we can go any further. Alright, the monkey is legitimately falling with me now after I gave him all the fucking bananas. So that's good. I know exactly what to do with him. I need him to hold a switch over here that will enable me to enter the plaza of the monkey head. Go monkey. Who's a good boy? Here. Chill out on this. Monkey. I need you to hold this monkey. Yeah, there we go. Add a boy. Alright. Well. Alright, we can walk around the monkey head. Oh. This is spooky. It looks like a sacred idol of some kind. What a cheap piece of mass produced tourist crap. <laughs> On the bottom it says made by Lemonhead. Well, Lemonhead. It looks like a sacred idol of some kind. Man, it looks like a, a lot of shit here. Of kind. I don't know which one is the uh, anti route they were talking about. It looks like a sacred idol of some kind. It looks like a sacred idol of some kind. It looks like a sacred right. idol. Oh, of some I don't know. Kind. Oh, hang on, hang on, hang on. Definitely the second biggest monkey head I've ever seen. Tell us more about the first. <laughs> I want to know. It looks like a sacred idol of some kind. Alright. Can I go around the other side? Monkey grounds. Nope. I just end up back here. Well, one of these has to be the right one. This is much too heavy to pick up. Huh. Let alone carry around this godforsaken island for god knows what reason. What about this one? This is much too heavy to pick up. Oh, man. Let alone carry around this godforsaken island for god knows what reason. This is much too heavy to pick up. Fine, pick up the baby one. Let alone carry around this godforsaken island for god knows what reason. I doubt anyone will miss this piece of junk. <sighs> oh, well. Maybe that'll do. Oh, Mr. Cannibals. I got something truly unbelievable for you. Where are they? Oh. Always sneaking up on me like well, that. Well, well. You're quite the escape artist, aren't you? I told you we should eat him. Don't eat me. I'll give you anything. Okay. We'll give you one more chance to trade something of yours for your freedom. Well... Well, this do the trick. Hey, wow, this is impressive. Lemonhead, take a look at this. <laughs> he made it himself. Oh, nice, and it says made by Lemonhead, just like one of mine. We should take this to the Great Monkey. Yes, I agree. We are very grateful to you for this fine gift. If there's You're anything welcome. you need on Monkey Island, just come see us. Wow. Bribery makes people so kind. Can I get the banana picker now? Sweet. Alright. Now i got to figure out where the hell Herman is. He'll probably be back at his, uh, stupid, uh... Whoops! Pick her back! Oh, here he is. But will they give it to me? They want the monkey head key back first! Ha! That'll be the day! Don't you think they're being unreasonable? It's not as though I'm asking for a lot. Shut the goddamn hell up! They want the monkey Just head take key it. back first! Be the day. Don't you think Take the goddamn thing, just shut up. Hey, thanks. 
I thought I'd never see this again. Here, you can take this key to the monkey head back to the natives. Hell no. Okay. And don't worry, I won't use it or anything. Yeah, I won't use it. Alright, let's go use the key. Alright, here we are. What? It's a Q-tip? Well, I think I know where to use that then. Let's get over there. I didn't know I was playing doctor. I don't know, use it, use it, use it. <laughs> Rose. He's like, oh. All right. You're in for a now, guy bush. Well, it's hot down here. Digging this jazzy pirate music. I had a feeling that in hell there would be mushrooms. <laughs> They're awfully fancy mushrooms. Wonder what kind of trip you could get from those. Alright. This is looking like a first risen now. Make sure it's Whoa, that is spooky. Now it's starting to look like it. Oh, amnesia or something. I can't reach it. You can't jump that? Hmm. How do I get across then? I can't reach it. You can look at it. Nothing to look at here. Okay, how the hell do I get around? Hmm. I am confused. What the? Man, what? That's the way I just came. What? Ah! What the hell's going on? It's different every time I come in. Gross. Pick him up. Yeah, I'd rather not touch it. All right. Moving along. Oh, great. I'm stuck again. Go this way? Nope. Back here. Head back, head back, head back. This is strange. What the hell do I do? Here we go. Hmm. Very maze like. Ew. Yuck. I think I need some breath mints. What do you say? That's refreshing. Alright, well, let's just keep going. Hi. Hey, whoa, whoa, what? What? Whoa, this is different. Ew. The hell is this place? It's fucked up. Creepy. There's a heart. Heart of Lorcan. Hellish. Hellish. Well, doesn't seem to be much choice here. I don't know if there's an actual like. Hang on, hang on, hang on. Sickening. Hmm. Oh my God. 
I wonder if... That doesn't seem to work. What the hell is minutes? There sure are a lot of spelling errors. I don't know what the hell that is. Seriously, where the hell do I go? I come out of there or this way? This looks new. More hands. Oh no, this isn't new, is it? Disgusting! Yeah, I'd rather not touch it. And I give it the Q-tip. Mm. This is so confusing. Ooh, how nauseating. Where do I go? Well, I'm on this side now. Weird. Can I just poke it? I'd rather not touch it. What do I do? Blah. Blah. Okay, so the deal is I need to somehow convince them to give me that navigator head. I don't suppose this is it. We couldn't take that. You've already given us so much. Well, I think they're having a serious discussion. Where's this uh, idol then? I was supposed to. Is it over here? It looks big and empty. Can I feed it a skull? That doesn't seem to work. You know what? Maybe this is the navigator head. So, let's try using it in the catacombs. Alright, time to give this a try. Whoops. That doesn't seem to work. What are you talking about? That doesn't seem to work. Ah. Uh. How the hell do I get the stupid head then? That doesn't seem to work. Can I talk to the head? That doesn't seem to work. Nope. Fuck! What a cute little skull. Well, it's not telling me anything. Maybe if I give him back the Q-tip. The key to the great monkey. Thank you very much. Ah! You sons of bitches. <clears throat> Excuse us, but we're in the middle of a serious discussion. I know, but I really need that navigator head thing. I told you, we only have one. We don't know how to get another one. Sorry. You better help me out. <clears throat> I told you, you can't have our head. We don't know how to get another one. Ah! Uh, here's a fucking head. Oh, we couldn't take that. You've already given us so much. Oh, we couldn't take that. You've Come on! Given us so oh, whoa, much. whoa, whoa! Hang on now. It's called how to get a leg up in treasure hunting. It's called How to Get Ahead in Navigating. Well, look at this. It looks like instructions on how to get ahead. We could give him our head and use these instructions to get ourselves a new one. Yes, I suppose we can give you this now. Thanks. Looks pretty good for a dried up old head, doesn't it? You. We keep it wrapped in this magical necklace that makes it invisible to ghosts. This is pretty creepy, actually. Oh, look! I think he likes you! 
Just follow his nose and he'll lead you to LeChuck's hideout in the catacombs. Then get the root from LeChuck and come back here. We'll mix up a batch of our special enzymatic ghost dissolving solution. And you can pour it on LeChuck like salt on a slug. Yeah. Good luck. Sweet. All right. Didn't take me particularly long to figure that out, but I just, I don't know. The horrors of act one just uh, haven't left me yet. And I hate being stuck on the same problem for hours upon hours. So now that we have the frickin' navigator head, it will lead us through the catacombs. I didn't think that pamphlet was gonna be useful, to be honest. I thought those were things that were just totally meaningless and that I could have gotten rid of in the uh, cauldron in Act 2. But apparently not. And I'm glad I remember that I even had that. It seemed like something I would have easily forgotten about, but, well. I didn't. Now I'm just wondering what the skull is for, though. I don't know. Not everything in this game seems to really have a use. So I still have a stupid staple remover. That wasn't useful for anything. I don't know if I mentioned it, but I found out the cauldron in Act Two you could have used to get rid of a lot of useless stuff. I could have probably gotten rid of these t-shirts. Minty Fresh, the uh, thingamajigs, staple remover. But now I'm stuck with them. It's apparently so hard to just chuck them to lava, for starters. Alright. Oops, I keep doing that. I think it wants me to go to the right. I just came from there. Oh, he seems very confused. I can't see what he's doing. He wants me to go to the right. And so we shall. Simple. He just keeps spinning now, he wants me to go to left. Why? Uh, yep. As I thought, I have noticed that it does change go one direction to another, which is kind of weird. Okay, see, now I have to go back. Um, buddy. Okay. Works for me. I read somewhere that it is possible to figure this out on your own, but I honestly don't see how. This is even more tedious than the uh, treasure hunt. You spin my head right round, right round. I'm not gonna sing. Oh, I'm gonna help. Okay, to the left. And. More left. Yep, keep going. Guess we're going this way. This is back where we started. This right, bro? Yep. Alright, to the right. Oh, snap! Oh, where are you going? Well, we found it. It's that eerie-looking ghost ship I saw sailing off with the governor. What a coincidence. All right. Let's board this vessel. Oh, snap. Well, this is interesting. Uh... I've come to interrogate the prisoner. Yikes! <laughs> that guy's a wimp. How could he scare me away? Right, 
so I gotta figure out how to get past him somehow. It's a fancy jig. I like it. Okay. Well then. Evidently. Oh shit, I didn't mean to do that. God damn it. No, that's not the dog from the bar, is it? Come on, I didn't want to do this. Alright, so what do I do then? Where are you going, bro? Perhaps I can use this. Here. Nothing to look at here. Oh, fine. Use a cannibal? Just throw it at the ship. I'm sure that'll be enough to sink it. Where are you going, bro? Um. The skull? That doesn't seem to work. Oh, snap. You can't have it. <laughs> it's mine. Well then. Ugh, it's slimy and goopy. That necklace is supposed to make it invisible, so if I wear it, I would be able to sneak past them. Okay, we're here. Now what do you want from me? May I please have that necklace? No. But thanks for asking so politely. You're welcome. Why can't I have it? I've got a bad feeling about this place. I think I might need it. Oh, come on, please. You can beg all you want, but you can't have it. What's preventing me from just taking it? Pretty please? You can beg all you want, but you can't have it. Uh, awfully stubborn for a dead Maybe guy. Maybe I'll just take it. Maybe you'd better not. What's that supposed to mean? I don't want to have to hurt you. And I don't want to have to make you regret it. Ooh. What are you going to do? Bite me? Remember, you need me to get out of this place. If I wanted to, I could strand you here forever. That's true. Maybe I could keep threatening him. If I wanted to, I could dropkick you into the lava. On second thought... <laughs> hey, what good's a necklace if you don't have shoulders? You stubborn old bastard. All right. Now, I can use a necklace. This feels weird. And I am supposedly invisible. Oh yeah. Jeez, I can't I can barely see where I am. Jesus. This is strange. Whoops. What was that? Okay, guess we're not going in there. Going down into the hold. He looks sound asleep. Hmm, who would have thought a dead man would need to sleep? Ooh, maybe we can take that. I can't get it away from him. Wait until he stretches again. Get it away oh, you bastard. That's annoying. I can't get it away from him. Oh. Guy's a fucking tease. Oh, snap. A lot of ghostly animals. 
They look like chickens. Gross, look at the meat. The hell are they? Oh, you can see the food going through them. That's creepy. Glowing crate, ooh. I don't see anything special uh, about suspicious. it. Open it. Well, except that big glowing blue anti root inside. <laughs> I can't get inside it. It's uh. nailed, chained, bolted, roped, glued, and welded together. So, bust it. That doesn't seem to work. Alright. Use the ink. That doesn't seem to work. Well then, where do I go from here? Oh, there's a hatch. It's locked tight. Must be something important down there. There's some way to open it? Jesus. Nothing's ever simple. Jesus, sounds that thing makes is creepy as hell. I can't get it away from him. What the hell do I do then? on him? That doesn't seem to work. Hmm. I don't see anything special about it. Go up. Alright, so I gotta figure out where to go. Surprisingly a ghost dog. Hey, what a cute little ghost dog. Surprised he, he's not smelling me or nothing. Well, they didn't notice that one at least. Oh, snap! Who dares to enter the cabin of the ghost pirate Nechuk? Nobody. Uh, must be the wind. Yes, indeed. I've got to distract him somehow, then. The wind makes not such a creaking. The ship sounds strange in these waters. Oh boy. What do I do? Looks like Monkey Island. Who said that? <laughs> hmm. Ugh, no thanks. What do I do? The skull? That doesn't seem to work. I can't whip that out in here. <laughs> Alright, so what do I do? Do I clonk him on the head with it? Ugh, no thanks. Hmm, this is gonna be tough. Very tough. Maybe I can start a fire in here. Nope. Flint works best with things made of steel. Flint on cannonball. Does nothing. There's gotta be something I can do in here. It's got little wriggling blue hairs in it. What can I do? That doesn't seem to work. The hell do I do? I don't see anything special about it. Oh, man. That doesn't seem to work. Oh, what do I do? What do I do? This is not straightforward. Well, none of this game has been so far, so... Can I use the ink on the door to make it squeak less? Gotta be something I can do there then. I don't see anything special about Go! It. The hooch. What if I give him the skull? No. I can't give him anything apparently. Oh, what do I do? That doesn't seem to work. 
Okay, I picked up a feather from the chicken. It looks like a bottle full of grog. Maybe. I can't find a ticklish spot on his body. <sighs> Fuck. Perhaps the guy on the ladder out here. I better leave him alone. Where then? Dog? I better leave him alone. What do I use it on then? I think I'll just stay on this side of the room, where it's safe. Ugh. I can't find a ticklish spot on his body. What the hell am I supposed to do with this? Oh, I can use it on his feet. I'll take that if you please. Now what do I do with it? I don't see anything special about it. Can I lube the squeaky door with it? I think I'd rather save it. Save it for what? I mean now I have a jug of grog. It's a bottle of ghost grog. Okay, what do I do with it? Do I get the pigs drunk? I think I'd rather save it. That was ridiculous. I gotta be honest, I would not have figured that out without a walkthrough. I mean, how the hell was I supposed to know that? I've had that compass for... I've had that compass since... Chapter 1. How would I know it's still supposed to be useful? Oh, whatever. Now I have the key. I believe the key goes to this. Now I can go down. Oh shit! Grease. Pick up some grease. Yikes! I hate rats. Okay, what do I do with them? Get them drunk. I think I'd rather save it. You gotta kill them somehow, don't I? That doesn't seem to work. I'm not going near that monster rat. Oh, there's a bunch of rats. Uh oh. Well, he sure likes that. He's a fan of the hooch. Oh! Got him quite drunk. Uh, no. No, no, no. Pick up Le Grease. Ugh, it's all over my hands. Alright, now we can open the door. I think, I imagine. What else would the grease be for? Alright. I have greasy paws. Please glob on door. Squeaking. Sweet. Oh, snap. Where the hell am I? Ah. Let's take the tools. Oh, good. More inventory. Sweet. He's asleep. Can we kill him? I'm assuming Elaine is in there. Hey, I bet the governor's in there. Well, we think alike. Don't know how we would get in there, though. I can't get to it. That big ghost's in the way. Alright. Hmm. 
perhaps these tools will open that chest? I don't know. I mean, how would it? They're just, it was like a shovel. A pickaxe, I suppose I could bust it open with a pickaxe. Let's just look They're at it first. They're glowing ghost tools. Okay, that's not enlightening at all. Let's try it on the crate. This should do it. Oh. Sure is a whole lot of nothing going on. Oh boy. Oh boy, oh boy. I can't pick that up. What? You mean you can't pick it up? I can't pick that up. What? What was the point? Open. Then what do we do with it? I'm supposed to pick up the root, aren't I? I'll just grab this old root and be on my way. So I can pick it up with a look function, but not with a pick up function. What nonsense. Alright, I think we're going back to uh, the, the, the village now. We shall be on our merry way. That'll happen next time. I'm tired. And yeah. Thank you guys for watching. Next episode, we will, I don't know, we'll do more stuff. We'll bring out back the route. And then possibly we'll be able to confront Lechuk with the exorcism potion. But until then, see you guys later.